Imagine if vaccines could be created at previously unimaginable speeds. That is becoming a reality thanks to new platform technologies that can rapidly create multiple vaccines designed to protect against deadly diseases, including COVID-19. So we've been looking for technology that could make a vaccine from discovery to being in a vaccine vial within a matter of weeks. When scientists detect a potentially deadly new pathogen, they can now map its genetic blueprint and synthesise small sections of it. These tiny harmless pieces of artificial genetic code are being used to create a safe, effective synthetic vaccine against the coronavirus that causes COVID-19. The manufacturing of the vaccine is going ahead. So we anticipate we'll be starting our clinical trial, our first clinical trial in June of this year. That will show if the vaccine successfully protects against COVID-19. We already know that the manufacturing partners we're working with can produce 5 million doses um, within a period of weeks. Going from from, millions to billions of doses then becomes a global effort. The new vaccine technology platform called RapidVac makes that much easier than before. Because each new vaccine is based on a genetic template, it can quickly be shared with vaccine manufacturers located around the world. That will allow enough vaccine doses to be equitably produced for the global population and much more quickly stop the spread of a pandemic disease. This will be particularly important for poorer countries that lack robust healthcare systems and have large populations living in dense urban cities and slums where social distancing is impossible. I think science is absolutely critical to getting out of this uh, pandemic. In the future, vaccine platform technologies such as RapidVac will be needed to rapidly and cheaply produce vaccines that can protect against other emerging diseases. COVID-19 needs to drive the discussion so that we don't get caught out the next time. Innovations like this will help us save more lives. Let's get behind the future of vaccines.